Welcome of UFC Unlimited Fight Channel. Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. Well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kicks, jumping high kicks, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, so, most people so, believe, yeah, his opponent is in a so world of trouble. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique, because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Or till the date for this, our main event of the evening. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. The veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It is Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 167 pounds. Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves is my first. Ready. So here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand. Early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? All right, here we go, early round one. We talk about wrestling being a great equalizer in MMA, but length and reach is another one. He's got a great jab. We'll see if he can employ it tonight. You have got to be born with it, right? You don't get taller. When you're a tall guy, you have to understand, make your skill set match your physical abilities. And this guy has done this tremendously. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Trying to go to the body now with the kick, that one misses. 
big kick land. Oh, high amplitude head kick. He went high on that one. Nice punch by Lee. Kick lands. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Got the single collar tie. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Just missed with that right hand. And that one certainly found the target. And they separate. Beautiful strike. Back and forth we go! To avoid the right. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body punch. Whiffs on the right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Oh, he got absolutely clutch, and that's as good a combination as we have seen out of him here tonight. The last time I saw a combination this good, it was Donald Cerrone beating up on Rick Stewart. Look at the angle of that nice body. Oh, a nice straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good move there. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have land, of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Lee gets caught with that punch. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Nice. Oh! It's very tricky when he throws that body. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. It's the right hook to the body. Single collar tie now. Lee's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do. Efficient with that jab, doubles up on it now. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's in some. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You can really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind your jab. Beautiful leg kick throw. All right, there's the clapper. Ten seconds to go. Big, straight left. Oh! How about those five minutes? Stop, stop, stop. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. Jump that round. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Keep throwing again. Throw it again. Effective strike there by 
Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, a little single collar tie there. Just unable to quite find that range. Bleeding from his cheek now. Lee gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Again, they will clinch. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Nice slip to avoid the left. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. All right, single collar tie now. And he oh, comes nice through game. with a big knee. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, straight right. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Just a slip there. Oh, he's out! Holy smokes! <laughs> Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 57 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoyed the birth of your kids, right? Yeah. But you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands, that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight...